Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Corner, and today I'm going to show you um, a redstone um, display um, that was made uh, by Teapotted. Um, so go check him out, and Antonation will be on the screen right about now. And uh, you can click that and go to his channel to see the original video for this. Um, his is much better. I think his was 24 pixels, something like this. This is Mine is 9 pixels, just because I wanted to recreate what he had done and show those who might not have seen it already. And just because I wanted a little wiring challenge, so to speak. And for those of you who watched the uh, Redstone for Noobs tutorial, which is back over there in that corner, um, this is what you can become um, redstone-wise. So I got a pressure plate set up right here so I can just step on it um, without having to press a button or anything. So I'm going to press it and go through the cycle and then I shall show the wiring. So let's go. So right now it just makes a little plus, not too exciting or anything. Um, that's all I've gotten into. do. Well, I mean, you can program it to do anything as long as you have the enough pixels. I only made mine 9 just because of how long it took me to make... Well, it didn't take too long, but it was just a little... Uh, it was good for what I wanted to build. I just wanted a little challenge in building redstone, and all credit for this goes to Teapot, and I'm not taking credit for any of his work, because um, his piston... Um, redstone um, wiring that he has that I'm going to show you is very clever and that's what makes this all work so let's go behind here and check this out um, so each pixel is nine pistons so a three by three square so like this bottom three by three right here bottom three by three right there is one um, pixel and you can go check out his video if you want to see the basics on how to wire it. I I did all this just by looking at his video, so that was pretty cool. Um, so basically what happens is for each frame, like these stay on, um, which turns those off, which means they stay unextended. And when these pistons go down, which is the butt the pressure plate down there is wired up to this tower of redstone, which sends a pulse out through these lines of repeaters um, which each um, go out to this so each little hole in the ground in one line is one frame so this is frame one frame two frame three frame four frame five so and that goes all the way up I just made it um, stacked so I can wire it up easy, uh, easier and then having it all over this place so this may look massive, but it's actually quite simple. Let's do the top layer, because then you can see that the best. So this one is wired up to these three pixels. So this is the middle top, um, the right top, if you're looking at it from that direction, the left top, and sneeze. <coughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> sneeze loading. Oh, let me set it to day real quick. There we go. So basically what happens is this one just makes the top part of the cross after the middle has been built. So um, the middle is built in the first three frames on the middle right here. So the first three frames are right here. So basically what happens is when this comes down, it basically says I want this pixel to be out for this frame. Because it blocks the current which turns that on, which turns this off, which turns those on or which turns those off which turns that on so it's it's a little bit confusing if you don't know what you're doing but if you look at this video it's pretty easy to figure out so i recommend you go check it out because he is awesome and it was a great video so um basically that's it so you can just program it i only made mine five frames but you can make it like a hundred if you want <laughs> if you had the time and space to do so and you can also make it as many pixels as you want. So you can make a whole 1080 pixel TV if you wanted to. Although you wouldn't be able to change the colors for the blocks. So we're going to look at it one more time. 
um, intonation for his channel or for the video of the his display is will be up in the top right corner up here somewhere and uh, I recommend strongly that you go check it out because without him I wouldn't have been able to build this so let's take one more look at it and there you go so thanks for watching this video um, I will have the redstone logic gates video out shortly a few days um, I'm gonna be gone this week so it will not happen this week so it'll be sometime next week well, actually I think I'm gone for the next three weeks actually so that redstone logicate video unfortunately will have to be delayed for a little while so um sorry for that but you know life happens so thanks for watching this video please leave a like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys next time